Hi everyone. Today's video, we're going to go over how to remove zeros from your Excel spreadsheet. So as you can see here, <clears throat> Hi everyone. In today's video, we're going to go over how to remove zeros from your cells in your Excel spreadsheet. Uh, before we get into that, um, if you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel. Check out the rest of our videos. Um, so what I have here is a balance sheet, and you can see that it has uh, a debit column, a credit column, and a total column. And then there's a couple formulas in here, and I'm going to show you how it works with formulas as well as just if there's a, just a regular zero amount in a cell just like this. So what we're going to do to do this, um, and the reason you want, might want to do this is because some, sometimes these zeros get a little bit distracting. You don't really necessarily need to see all of the zeros and kind of clutters everything up. So what we're going to do is we're just going to come up here to file and then we're going to click on options. And then we're in the Excel options. We're going to go down to advanced and then we're going to scroll down to display options for this worksheet. And there's a checkbox here that says show a zero in cells that have zero value. And we're just going to uncheck that box and then click OK. And now all of your zeros are removed. So to get them back in there, you just do the same exact thing. File, options, and then go to advanced, scroll down to display options for this worksheet. And you can see it's just going to apply it to this one worksheet right here. So there's a drop down. If you had multiple tabs, you could drop that down. But um, we're just going to click on show a zero in cells that have zero value. Click OK. And your zeros are back. So as you can see, this works with even though there's a function in here, it still removes the zero. And if it's just a regular zero, it takes that out as well. So hopefully, hopefully you enjoy the video and uh, we'll see you all next time.